Hey guys, Toolman Tim here. Welcome back to the workshop where we build business, create community, find freedom, and share success. It's Tuesday, which means it's time for another Toolbox Tuesday. And I have got an extra special one for you. With Father's Day right around the corner, and we all know that we love to get little gadgets, and we love to put little hints out there for the family of little things that we'd love to get, I thought I would do my top five under 40 Father's Day tools that you can pick up on Amazon. So hang in there, I'll be right back. All right guys, real quick, if this is your first time to visit my channel, welcome to the workshop, I appreciate it. And if you wanna check out everything there is to know about me and what I do and my content creation, go to toolmantim.co, that's toolmantim.co. You can go there and I have an entire section of over 100 products not selling anything, just pointing you in the right direction, to solutions to problems, things like my kids spilt paint on vinyl siding, how do I get rid of it? And I need to hang a really heavy picture on a wall and I can't drill a hole, what do I use? Products I've figured out work really well in my business, have either made me money or saved me money. So go by there, check it out, sign up for the newsletter, and that is that. Okay guys, so, like I said, I did a segment on a podcast recently, five under 40. And I thought, hey, let's adapt that, turn this into a video, because who doesn't love getting really cool gifts? My kids asked my wife the other night, what does dad want for Father's Day? And they know the answer, Home Depot gift cards, Amazon gift cards, because if they try to pick out a tool, I love them, but you know how it is. It's, it's the old, uh, you know, tie with cartoons on it, or socks or underwear, or whatever. And they mean well, and I love my kids, but... We always love to pick out our own gifts, especially once we get to be adults, hey guys? Anyway, but if your kids or your wife, or if this is a wife or a kid watching this video looking for suggestions, I thought I'd throw five kind of cool everyday things that dads might like that they might not have went out and bought on their own so that you can surprise them with something really cool. And who doesn't love, if you're anything like me, practical, cool, handy, neat, different. Those are the type of things that I like to pick up for presents at, you know, Christmas, Father's Day, that kind of thing, because it might not be something I'd pick up for my business or for me right away. So without further ado, in no particular order, here are the five tools that I've picked up off of Amazon in the last few years, last year really, that I really like and I think, you know, the special man in your life will like, or if you're one of my subscribers watching this, you might get some ideas of hints you can leave for the kids and the wife of products you might like. So number one, and this is in the practical realm of things. To me, this is way more practical than socks and underwear, but I still like it. This is the Milwaukee multi-bit ratcheting screwdriver. Every junk drawer in every house needs to have one. And I grew up, I had one of these kind of bright green ones in my junk drawer at home. And it was good. It served its purpose. I'm a handyman by trade and I needed something. I like to have as small a kit as I can to go and deal with emergencies. So I needed a ratcheting screwdriver. Now, if you guys know me, I am a DeWalt cordless tool kind of guy, which you can't see a whole lot of right there. But when it comes to hand tools, Milwaukee seems to be making the best. So if you're looking for something that you'd like to have, you'd like to put well, in a stocking at Christmas, but you'd like to give to your uh, special man on Father's Day, you can never go wrong with a ratcheting screwdriver. It's built like a tank. All the bits are held on board, and it just absolutely works. I love this thing. I use it all the time. When I go on site, I don't even grab my other screwdrivers anymore. This is it. Pick up one to have in your toolbox and one to have in the junk drawer that you can never get closed in the kitchen because it's a junk drawer. All right, number two, and this was a really cool one. This is one I first seen on an Instagram ad, and for whatever reason, I tend to buy a lot of tools that I see on Instagram because they got the kind of cool factor. Now, if you guys remember back, <clears throat> well, if, if you're an 80s kid and a 90s kid like I was, do you remember those cool flip-out switch, switch blade combs where we always thought we were, you know, a crazy kind of gang member or we just, you know, thought we were uh, somebody out of grease or something? Well, this has that factor to it. Check this out. So that is the Stanley Folding Compact Chisel. I love this thing. I always had just a cheap, no-name brand chisel in my toolbox. And like my dad says, 
Whenever you buy a tool, you always find more uses for the tool than you thought you had. And that's the way a chisel was. Before I used to use a, <laughs> a slot screwdriver, I'm almost ashamed to talk about it. But now I switched over to a chisel and every time I reached into my toolbox, it either wanted to bite me or had got dull from being trudged around, not being used for a month. So I thought, hey, how cool is this? Folds up, comes back out, helps protect the edge, although if you can see it, ooh, that's a little shiny there. It ends up uh, getting, it needs to be sharpened. But what I love about this is how beefy and sturdy that is. The gears right there work, just work perfect every single time. And it has the cool factor because we can pretend we're back in elementary school and we're like, what a, you know, so there it is. <laughs> All right, now number three, what man or what man in your life loves putting together Ikea furniture? I can almost bet none of them because my wife knows that I would rather have a root canal than walk through Ikea. However, in my business, I do a pretty good business with putting together Ikea furniture. Now, I know everybody hates it, so if there's a way that I can make it 10% suck less, maybe we can do that. So, here's what I found on Amazon. The Nico brand, these are hex keys, Allen keys. Of course, you know, pro tip, everything basically that comes from Ikea is metric. So, now don't over torque this kind of stuff, but I want to get that in there so you can see. These have an impact piece on them. Now, it may not mean a lot to a lot of people, but... That is a time saver for a lot of us. So this snaps into your impact driver and you can use it. Now, don't crank it down and wreck things. But if you curse quite a bit <laughs> every time you have to use that tiny little Allen key that comes with every piece of uh, IKEA furniture that you've ever found and you want a way to speed up the process a ton, these are absolutely it. There's a bunch of different brands on Amazon. I'll have links in the description below. But that's the one that I've loved. I like it so much that I haven't even done a review on it yet. I had to throw it in this video because these have been a game changer. I put together a bed frame the other night and it just helped me be a slightly less frustrated. So if you're looking for something kind of cool, very practical and something that not all the other dads have, I like that. All right, now number four. And this was, I hate using the word game changer because it sounds so cliche, but this absolutely was. Number one, who doesn't like playing with lasers, right? There you go. So this is the Bosch laser tape measure. And guess what it does? I can point it across there and it can tell me that to my garage door it's 16 foot one inch. That's all it does. It'll hold two measurements. You can take the measurement of a room, snap a picture of it with your digital uh, camera on your phone, just like that. Absolute, I, I, I love it. So I used to go and eh, this thing is way more accurate than you'd absolutely think. But anything inside of 16 feet, unless you're putting up crown molding, th this works. So I go to do a measurement or a quote for a customer, and it used to be, get out the tape measure, pull it out. Cuss when you get it caught on the uh, the moldings there, because it won't come out. Try to try to retract it, give it a, sway, uh, a hit, a hit, won't come up, walk over, bend over, pick it up, retract tape measure, repeat process for every room. Now I go in, I go bang, bang, click with my phone, and I'm done. What dad... What man doesn't want to have a cool, well, plus it's a very expensive laser pointer for cats, which I like. But, so basically you just hit the buttons, it measures what you need, and you're good to go. Simple, it does something, it does it really well, and it has that cool factor of having a laser on it. Good up for 65 feet. So check it out, and again, link's in the description below, but if you're looking for something kind of cool and you want to surprise your dad or husband or special man or whatever, there it is. Now... Number five, ratchet straps are to me like Tupperware are to my wife. You can never have enough and you can never find them when you need them. Or like the lids, you're missing the lid but you have the bottom, I'm missing the top but I don't have the strap with the ratchet strap. So for a long time I used to buy the cheapest ratchet straps that I could find at my local dollar store. And then I got into business and I needed something a little bit beefier. And I picked these up at Costco but they're absolutely... Uh, available on Amazon, which is really cool. These are the Cat brand ratchet straps, and they are thick enough and wide enough that they hold up really well, but they're not too heavy that they look like the ones that the guys in the transport trucks have to crank down with a big bar. They come in a four pack, usually four is enough. I have eight now because I tend to lose them or I throw some in another truck. But what man doesn't love to throw a ratchet strap over something and then tighten it down, snap it, and say, Yep, that ain't going nowhere. 
and this brings that joy into our lives. Trust me, I know a lot of people are like, ratchet straps, that's not very practical. Well, that's as practical as they come. Who doesn't love a ratchet strap? And these Cat brand, which is the my third favorite yellow and black tool brand, is absolutely the way to go. So if you're looking for something practical, you just want to, you know, if you're not going to go the, the road of a Home Depot or Amazon gift card and you want to surprise them with something really cool, any one of these. Milwaukee ratcheting screwdriver, Stanley switchblade, I'm ah, just kidding, flip out chisel, Bosch digital tape measure, the Nico impact branded Allen key hex keys, which will cause you to swear just a little less when putting together Ikea furniture, or number five, the cat brand ratchet strap, the Tupperware for guys that like to haul stuff. So anyway, guys, that's it for me. If you like this video, share it. If there's something in here that even you're just interested in, go over to the Amazon link because it's in the description below. Click on them and check it out. If you end up buying anything whatsoever in the next 24 hours, my content gets a small percentage of that and it helps support everything I put out. So thanks, guys. And tune in. If you haven't subscribed and you like this kind of thing, tune in. Every Tuesday, I got a Toolbox Tuesday. Every Wednesday, a uh, Tool Time Gear Review. Five videos a week. You'll love it. Anyway, guys, as always, stay happy, stay healthy, and have a great week.